Hey Legionnaires and welcome back, we're here with some CK3 for you today, it's finally been released, I've been looking forward to this for a long long time. We are going to play as Wessex and try and form the Kingdom of England, as you know I am a, uh, a Brit myself and you know, I want to unite the uh, all the Saxon kingdoms and even the Viking ones, it was seen as a, a Jorvik there, that's where I'm from, in the north and uh, yeah it seems like that's already held by the Vikings, we definitely want to come down and uh, well go up in fact and uh, take all these uh, these lands for ourselves. I've played a little bit of the tutorial very quickly um, but it seems all very similar to uh, a CK2 which I've uh, played more than enough so uh, I think we know what we're doing and I'm, it seems like I'm already at war in uh, at war with uh, looks like uh, well the Isles and, and uh, well also looks like we're at war with uh, well there's an inv oh no these are invasions oh am I at war with them? It looks like I am uh, I am in this war, and uh, looks like we are fighting, well, Jorvik, this chap, and Upland. So it looks like we're in a lot of wars anyway, straight off the bat, so we can probably go march up north and go and uh, deal with uh, these people. I mean, yeah, anyway, if you would like to see more CK3 on the uh, channel, then please remember to leave a like, subscribe if you're new around here, and a comment to show your support. And uh, yeah, we're going to certainly be doing like, I don't know, 20, 25 minutes or long episodes. And uh, see how how we do anyway. And I'll, I'm sure I'll put our few in the next few days to show off uh, this great game. And it looks like anyway, we're going to have to be raising our armies soon. I'm going to put it on two speed to start with. While uh, I'm just seeing what happens. Uh, faction targeting you has disbanded. Excellent. Right. Actually, there's a point. We have a few things to deal with anyway. Um, so we probably don't need the encyclopedia. I understand. Get rid of that. Anyway, let's choose the lifestyle. So uh, our guy is really good at stewardship. I would kind of like to raise up that marshal, try because uh, we're in a time of war, and we could do with uh, some more of that. So uh, we're going to go with um, probably strategy, because that seems like a very good one to go with. Marshal experience, 25 every month. Um, this can only be changed once every five years. That's fine. I am then going to go down like all these perks, and we'll get to like strategist at the bottom eventually. Um, we then got domain uh, domain limit. We have far too much domain. It would seem in our ourselves yeah we actually do wow we have a lot um but let's have a look can we see the like the duchies themselves so i mean this is could give a whole duchy way over here this is probably why my uh my lands are far too little but we're gonna go to my court i'm just gonna give these guys to a uh, random thing so i'll give a uh, this chap here i'm gonna give you grant you some titles i'm gonna give you sir i'm gonna give you blooming kent so i'm sure you'll uh you'll love kent so i think Actually, let's undo that. I'm not really sure what I've just given you. So let's give you all of Flipping Ken. Uh, let's grant you that title. There you go. You become my vassal as a member of Ken. That's really weird though when you like zoom in and like, uh, I don't know, this is really weird. Oh, it's uh, so good to have it, but at the same time, it's so weird. Uh, can I create titles? Uh, I have the Kingdom of. Oh no, I've. Is your kingdom of England okay? Pay. Oh no, because I am a duchy rank. Ah, okay, yeah, yeah. Of course, I forget that the kingdom of Wessex is just a mere, just a mere. Uh, well, duchy. That's just that's what it is. Um. Anyway, yeah, we're giving one of my commanders that. Um. I could probably try and get some more stuff. I could try and. I could uh, search for his position. Probably should do that at some point. Um. Yeah. Let's search. Oh yeah. Start. Start the search for position. Um, that'll be good. I don't need thanks. I'm glad I know that this is gone. That's great. Um, yeah, rally point is in win uh, there. Okay, I just need to get more people. Hand out some more lands. Uh, recruit to court. I could. I could just give you Uhtred. Yeah, let's. You know what? This guy he just he's low born. Uhtred. How old are you? Oh, you're 64. I'm okay actually. Uh, you're 62. Wow, these people are really old. <laughs> there we go. Wolf. This man here, he's a lowborn, but he can have some lands. I will give you, uh, I'll give you Sussex. There you go, sir. You're now the Earl of Sussex. You are just some random house, the House of Blues. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna, I might just quickly cut, deal with all this. Uh, how many, how many uh, tiles can I have? That's a quick question. Um, I would say. Oh, I'm only allowed seven. Yeah, so I might just come back in a moment. I'll just cut in a moment back. 
when I've dealt with all of the uh, the added like stuff here of like uh, titles etc. So there we go. We have sorted out all my uh, vassals. We now have plenty of different vassals all loitering around there at different areas. I may need to raise my armies. Um, so we're just going to quickly have a look at levies. I can now get 16,000 men and they all cost absolutely nothing apparently to uh, raise up. So I might be doing that in a moment. Uh, how many men has Mercy got? Certainly not enough. Not as much as uh, me, it would seem. Fighting strength here is huge. Um, so it looks like the Vikings are actually... Well, plans to do so. What are they trying to do? Sons invade Northumberland. I'm kind of okay with them invading Northumberland, though. They're invading East Anglia. Who are these? These are the Isles. Oh, well, they're just... They're pretty insignificant to me, I think. Yeah, you have... Oh, I say that. They have 6,000 men. Uh, so maybe not. We will see. I would like to really uh, kind of fabricate a claim on you. Sway. I can sway poo... Oh, right. Well, it's like sway to get into, like control or something like that. But we have a wife. It could probably do with uh well sorting uh getting a getting a child. How old are you? You're thirty six in fairness. Might need to murder you. You are a I mean we could always have uh, this guy in charge. He's pretty uh eighteen. I wouldn't be opposed to that. If we don't have any kids, then there's always Alfred. Uh, that is there. I mean, I think oh, that's Alfred the Great, isn't it? Um, so <laughs> that might be the case. We might be able to have Alfred the Great as uh, my guy in charge, um, which is perfectly fine. Um, I could. I'll pay. I'll pay twenty. There you go. Twenty become my court physician. That's what I was sorting out. That's what we need to sort out. Uh, anyway, yeah, East Anglia is also uniting its armies. We seem to be pushing stuff up. I will raise, we'll raise the armies. Why not? Raise all the armies. Raise all armies and send them in that general direction. I like how we just have a red banner. Don't have anything else. No, we don't bother with the uh, actual banners. Um, but yeah, I don't actually. Let's have a look. Split off higher troops. Disband army. Split off new army. Split in half. Yeah, okay, so we just have one commander. You don't have three, like, the three flanks that you used to in the old CK2. Which I kind of a bit of a shame about, because that was good to have, like, three different commanders. Um, I'm going to send my army north, I guess. And I'll see if I can uh, deal with the forces in Jorvik. And burn their lands. They shouldn't be coming in invading. We'll go and take the east riding. East riding of Yorkshire. See what we can do there. We'll link up with the uh, Northumbrian forces. Hopefully, these guys can help. The uh, army of Norwich and the army of Warwick would be quite good. Oh, there's a lot of Vikings coming south. Oh my gosh. Maybe we should defend uh, East Anglia. Looks like Northumbria might be a bit doomed. But we could definitely defend East Anglia. Oh my gosh, you don't move quick. I'll put it like that. Uh, yeah, Northumbria is not looking so good. But we can definitely defend East Anglia. Unite it possibly under our own lands. And then um, go for like the north on our own. We might want to, get to try and get some marriages as well with uh, various some people. We've got like Catholicism as our main faith. Uh, we'll be definitely wanting to keep that there. We've got Anglo-Saxons as our culture. And uh, we'll be doing our own bits there. Yeah, let's, let's have a fight. Go on then. I will battle you for uh, these lands here. Yeah, well, we should win this. Should. It's the main thing. They have low quality with superior quality in troops. Uh, their general is just some random guy. I have no idea who he is. Uh, we have won a battle. Victory. Uh, yeah, okay. Nothing there. No, didn't take any leaders or anything like that. Are you going to actually help? If I was to uh, come over here. But who knows? I mean, these are, the chieftain of Orkney is now involved in this war. That's not great. They have a lot of troops here now. They've rallied so many troops. It's gonna go north. I like that they have like all the little bits on the like they have like towns and they have bishop pricks now on here. This is so good. And he looks like he's sieging down this. So I might go and join him and siege down uh, the fort in Norfolk. We really need to take that back. He's clearly taking this, and that whole region's now all theirs. So we need to take that back. Um, yeah, it's nearly, I mean, Siege in Progress, it's nearly halfway, so that's good. We can do stuff there. Um, 
But we've got some other stuff going on now. Uh, bishop endorsement. Uh, your faith is... Da, 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 da. These bishops may immense power. Okay, I understand. Thank you very much. Uh, decisions. We have stuff we can do, but we can't find anything. We've got a decision, I thought. Yeah, I thought we have a decision. Decision. I don't know. Maybe not. The position is not the issue now, right now. <laughs> We've got to uh, come down here and come and deal with these goddamn Vikings. We're well, one five. I'm gonna try and catch one of them, but they won't. Uh, they won't raise any troops to come and help with me. How much for mercenaries? I wonder. Because, uh, mercenaries are always useful. Oh, they are far too expensive. Yeah, we have got nowhere near enough gold. The cheapest one are like 131, and they are, oh no, they're not, um, 171 for us. They've got poor troops here. Northumbria, look at that, is lost. Northumbria is well and truly lost. Are there armies? Mm, yeah, no, they still got a lot of armies. How's that? That's doing okay. You're going to take that just about enough time. Okay, here we go. Um, Lollards in East Anglia. East Anglia has announced the world that his vassals are compared to Lollardy. Well, should we really help? This is a twisted mockery of our faith. Lollardy of his there. You know they do have some points. No, this is a twisted mockery. Okay, so they've changed. So really, do we want to defend these guys? They have literally just turned defeat. The sons of... Uh, so be it. Yeah, I, there was no way I could stop that one. Northumbria is probably lost to Jorvik. That's not great, but... Um, yeah, there's not much I can do there. And now they've joined the war to try and take East Anglia. Not good at all. Brilliant. Um, we could be in for a rough old time here. I need to come and take out some of these armies. If they join up with me, though, it's, they'd be so much better. On the march. And I, the idea, the end of the field excise them to really idea. Practice of regrouping army to Surrey. Um, you gain self-sufficient soldiers for five years. Um, yeah. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's see if we can achieve that. Uh, I've not got enough po a coin. Uh, yeah, we'll lose the coin. I think we've got enough coin there to try it. They're now going into Mercy. They're splitting off their forces. Oh my gosh, there's so many pop-ups in this game. But my outroad has brought me the news. Da -da 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 -da. Um, you gain 10 dread. I don't want to really get... Um... Who are you? Oh, let's do it. Just for the hell of it. Let's try it. I don't know. <laughs> Interesting to see. We cut off this army, though. We're going to cut this guy off. So that's the X. We're going to... Oh, we're not. You gain that self-declared divine right for five years. That is... That's a theocracy. That's not great. Um, I can spend that. You have a dead fleet. I have divine right. Oh, we'll go with that. That's be exciting. On the march. Okay, I gained a... After that, I gained one perk. Excellent. That's brilliant. I, I won it. Oh no, that's not good. Mercy is losing that fight. I can come and save them. Ride to the aid. Right. We've got a perk. Let's have that unlock. Thank you. Get rid of that. Let's go and join the fight against. Um, well, who is this? The Chieftain of Ork. Ork We're not going to win. Because, <laughs> I mean, look at that. Yaldum Yorvik is bringing down so many more men. But we have now turned the tide of the battle here. The men of Wessex will save the day. Inheritance. Um, oh, we have lost this. Why was that? Ken has been... Uh, okay, well, we'll deal with that then. As and when. Right, let's get my army out of there. Because Jorvik is coming. They're coming fast. I think... It is lost. I don't think we can physically keep them al uh, it alive. I don't know. Let's see. I'm going to just quickly pause. I'm going to put Kent, put someone in charge, Kent. Who's got, you've got caught probably in Sussex, haven't you? Easy way to uh, sort out titles. You just find someone in someone else's court and you give them the title, even if they're not the best suited people. But we are certainly having to sort this out. We've got victory there, great. Protecting against other factions. You have a faction form against you. Ah, oh, have I? Well, okay. Let's deal with that. Entry. Factions. Oh, no, that's factions. Uh, one's independence from their liege. Military power. One member. This guy here. And he's... Well, he can... He's getting raided, so he can uh, do what he likes. But we need to go and take the Barony of Ipswich back. At all costs. They keep landing troops elsewhere. Oh, no, 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 no. That's a lot of troops to go into. 
That's 6,000 men. I don't think we could... Actually, I say that. They have a lot of... That's poor quality. But the numbers might tell. Uh, five of claiming increased opinion. Um, are you not got a great opinion? Yeah, this is not a I'm shy. Oh, dear. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, they caught me. Anyway, while I was doing that, they've managed to catch me. And I thought maybe that would be enough. Counselor has died. Okay, so we have a council position that is open. Steward, you are the best steward, I believe. No, you are. Let's have you then. And we lost that battle. That is not good. Um, because now we've got... Oh, yeah, we've got a lot of troops that we need to uh, replace. I hate all these pop-ups, though. Can we... Uh... I mean, that's great, but I mean, at the same time, I don't need those pop-ups there. Yeah, I have troops that... Hmm. I wonder if I disband a few, then uh, bring some back. I've got knights. Um, force must join your armies as a knight. Force pro ass, pro ass. Okay, so I can force these guys to join my armies. Don't know if uh, I want to do that. I don't know. What's the use of having knights, I wonder? Recruit to court. Hmm. Should these guys... Yeah, these guys should uh, replenish, I'm pretty sure. Um, defeat. Oh, there you go. That's not great. Uh, he's, they, they've done it, basically. Disband all armies because we've got no need for them now. They've taken this area here. I mean, they don't have as many men. Oh, maybe they do. They're replenishing them. They didn't have as many armies as before, but I wonder if that's because of the sort of... Like, they have almost abilities just to take it under siege. Hereford was under siege, but it's not anymore. They're now fighting over someone else. What are you fighting over? What are you fighting over? Oh my god, they're still fighting the like Northumbria up here? They're allied with Jorvik. They're fighting all sorts of people. They're fighting each other, which is good. I'm going to get ready to fabricate a claim on you, sir. Can I declare a war? Show your, your claims. I have claims on this? Uh, okay, let's have a look. What do I have claims on? I'm going to pause ever so quickly and have a look. I have claims on the Earldom of Devon, which I have given away. Devon is... Oh, no, Devon I do have a claim on. Wow. Um, yeah, let's go for a war then. How many men? You have 500 men. Yeah, I'm going to take your lands and your people. Declare war for Devon. Give me Devon or... Well, you're in trouble. Uh, raise the armies. Raise all armies. There we go. Pause. Come pause. Let's go to war. Let's take these guys out. My commander is Alfred. I'm currently my heir. <laughs> He's still my heir because my other guy won't have any goddamn children. Catch this guy. Cheeky. Cheeky man. Right. We'll get him there though. 2,000 men against 600. And we'll win that fight. Even with their quality. Send the, men, send the army to Devon. Where is their keep? There it is. Let's siege down that. We've got victory. Excellent. Dismiss. I don't even know about that. Let's turn the music down. He's getting very excited that we can do that. I can ransom this guy? Yeah. Let's ransom. Sure. Always do with more money. Uh, greetings from the pay. I accept the ransom. Okay, thank you. I don't need to. Can I just. I don't want to know about these ransoms anymore. Um, I'm. Yeah. Okay, who the heck are you? Don't know, but they have an ally of the. <laughs> they have an ally of the Franks, but I don't think they're coming over here anytime soon. Also, how the heck did I claim this? Dorset owns this. He managed to go on and claim some land in Brittany. What? <laughs> Okay, well, it seems like we're doing our expansion into the France for some reason. Oh my gosh. But yeah, I'm sure like this guy here is uh, visiting his own wars. Yeah, he's in so many wars of his own. Or well, three. A whole three. He's fighting someone for uh, in the like the east. Um, obviously, we're starving here, but we're doing okay. Um, yeah, I imagine I'll get used to like this a bit more and more. I've literally like thrown myself into it. We're going to see how it goes. Hope you guys are enjoying anyway. Um, if you are new to tw uh, to like Paradox Games, it is, uh, well, very different. Put it like that. Okay, open faith to you. I don't need, okay, whatever. I'll do that later. I've got a 
perks I need to sort out. Organized march. Uh, movement speed. Oh, I could do naval speed. Parthian. We're going to go with organized march because we've got no Parthian. We don't need cavalry. We don't have... Uh, siege effectiveness might be useful. Actually, I was looking at... Should have possibly looked at that. I control Devon now. That's the main point. Um, we'll go on and take out the barony of that Cornwall. And we'll take these... Uh, these 100 men out as well. But yeah, so I mean, the, the UI is like kind of confusing for all of these, but uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I opened Faith earlier, didn't I? I don't know, I'll deal with that later. I'm busy fighting wars in Devon to care about your faith. Piety, re renown. Oh, that's new. Renown, I don't think was a thing before. And, like the old CK2. But I could be wrong. Um, who's just come across? You've just come across. Who are you? The chief of going. You're not in this war, so that's fine. They also have 2,000 men. They, actually, I have nearly as many men as West Frank here. Jeez. That is kind of kind of crazy. Uh, oh, he's not swayed. Um, oh, oh, that's for like... I think I was trying to make him friends or something like that. I could be wrong. Scheme. Yes, I'm trying to scheme and trying to get him to uh, become friendly, I presume? I don't know if that's really necessary. He seems to be fine. Seems to be happy. Doing his own thing. I'm really struggling to see faith. Like the faith... Oh, here we go. Is this what it's meaning? Now, what's it wanting me to do? Doctrines. Okay. Let's quickly just pause and we'll see what this is going on then. Doctrines. Uh, oh, it's wanting me to do like male dominate. Um, okay, doctrines, yeah. Further. Oh, this. So yeah, like there's a lot of... Oh, okay, they're opposing faith, so I guess we're, we hate every other faith right now. Great. Um, next, I guess, new faith. Uh, create a new Christian faith. Well, I've got no need for that. Oh, and these are the main, these are the main doctrines of that. Okay, okay, I understand. Thank you. I don't need to know any more about this. I understand. Go away. Go away, you horrible, horrible thing. Uh, but yes, we'll carry on our siege of Devon, and we will uh, take Devon for ourselves. But it looks like we're, I was about to say I would usually be probably be cutting some stuff out, but uh, has cl has a claim on this guy has a claim on Holland. You are my court. You're my guest. How have I got you here? I don't need you. Neighboring ruler has won a war. Who won the war? Uh, you won a war in Wales. I'm not so like, don't care about that. I do want to go into Wales. So I mean, I want to kind of go out up this way. Maybe go to war with Mercia at some point. They have a lot. Oh my gosh, who are they fighting? They're in a war against Gwynn and in a war against Jorvik and the Jorvik. Oh, they're trying to take Lindsay. That's not good. My goal is still the same. I probably should actually try and ally with these guys. Could arrange a marriage, but no one here of any use. I arrange a marriage between you and... No, I can't. Anyway, a new opponent. My goal is still the same. Uh, this is no longer the best course of action. I can just make peace? Well, no. I'm just going to... Oh, he's taken this land. We're now just fight. We're now not fighting for. Uh, we're not fighting Cornwall. We're fighting this guy here. Well, that's just rude. That's just rude indeed. And I don't think he can take Winchester. He's not gone. So we are back, and I do apologise. It seems like both my OBS and CK3 decided just to crash all at the same time. And uh, yeah, it feels so weird just to say CK3. Um, I want, I hope you guys are enjoying it just as much as me. If you've got it, let me know in the uh, comments. It'd be really interesting to know who's uh, actually gone out and got it. And well, we could possibly, like when I uh, do start a stream, start to do a lot of uh, CK3 streams. Because I think it's definitely a game that needs, it's, it's better p playing on stream than it is just doing episodes. I will do, um, these episodes will be like fairly short-ish. So I don't want to bore you guys because sometimes nothing goes on. But uh, as you can see here, the world has very much changed already. Uh, Northumbria owned most of this land, and North Yorvik's just come in. East Anglia's gone, uh, which is kind of good because Lola, they were, became Lollards. But we now got Vikings on our doorstep, which is not a big fan. But they are allied with a lot of people, actually. They're allied with a lot of people. Yeah, especially Yorvik, who have like 5,000 men. Oh, and Lothians has come up and just wiped out... Um, Northumbria, jeez, so they're gone. That's a shame. Um, we're starving here. They are actually, have they actually brought more people into this war. They have brought these guys, and I mean the French are still in this, but we don't care about the French. This is nearly over, and then we can go and take out those uh, 
There we go. Or is that... Can I uh, force peace? Can I even force demand? Will not accept. Okay. Let's just... Let's have a quick battle. Kill these guys off. Uh, who's this? Estimated completion. Oh, he's raiding. Okay. Ah. Well, I'm learning. I'm learning. Yeah, so we break... Broken the siege by looks good. Oh, no, we haven't. There we go. We're going to kill them instead. And our, our knight has been wounded. Oh, and he's got a face mask now. Excellent. And I, Earl Alfred has been wounded by Dag. What a poor name. But he's not wounded, but he's still looking great. He still looks glorious as ever. Now you take my demands. On four stands. No, you won't. We'll beat you again then. Wherever necessary. Where are you retreating to? You're going over there. Hunt you down. Uh, oh, are these guys still not my wall? No, you're fighting. Oh, well, you're trying to take Devon back. Well, that's not going to happen, Chief. Can I enforce demands now? You'll not accept demands. They usually accept it at 99% in the old CK2. It was so annoying, right? Uh, they won't do that now, though. Let's go try and go back down here. They're going to try and go for Devon, aren't they? They're going to beeline for Devon. There we go. Enforce demands. So be it. There we go. It's now part of Wessex, and there we go. We've taken more land. This man's armies, please. Um, we've taken more land. I'm going to pause it there. I'm probably going to wrap up today's episode just there, or the first episode anyway. Um, we've taken, like, land in uh, Devon. We've also got bits of Brittany, which I didn't plan to take, but we've got it anyway. Um, but yeah, so our plan, our journey to reconquer England and unite the land has begun. And uh, hopefully in the next episode we can plan to maybe take out maybe some bits of uh, Wales and Mercia just to like gather more strength and maybe start an offensive against the Isles, who knows. But anyway guys, if you enjoyed, please do remember to leave a like, subscribe if you're new around here and a comment to show your support. And until next time, Legionnaires, 